Well, hello guys, it's Chris. From giant 14-story drops to spinning around in a whirlpool, here are 13 of the world's most thrilling water slides. Number 13, Insano. If you're looking for a chance to go on the world's tallest water slide, then you'll have to go to Fort Elisa, Brazil, and head to the Beach Park Water Park. Here, you'll find the Insano. This massive water slide is 14 stories tall, and you'll be doing a near vertical drop into the pool below. You'll be going a blistering 62 miles per hour at top speeds, and since you're going so fast, the ride only lasts five seconds. But during that five seconds, it's said you're not even touching the slide most of the time, and then you have to cross your ankles and arms to ensure you go down it safely. Granted, this isn't for everyone, but for those who want the thrill of racing down to the bottom at blinding speeds, the Insano is definitely for you. Number 12, Leap of Faith. The Leap of Faith water slide in the Atlantis Water Park in the Bahamas is easily one of the most visually detailed water slides in the world, mainly because you actually start your descent at the top of a Mayan temple, which I'm sure is something marvelous to behold even before you go and do the drop. But then you'll begin a 60-foot drop almost straight down. But you don't just stop at a nearby pool like with most water slides. That would be too easy. Instead, you actually go through a see-through tunnel, one that has you going through a shark-filled lagoon until you eventually reach the end of the ride in clear waters. Goodness, no sharks there. So in a way, you're going to have a great view from the top during the ride and as you reach the bottom. So what's not to love? Number 11, Black Anaconda. Dubbed America's most thrilling water coaster, the Black Anaconda is actually a hybrid of a water slide and a roller coaster, which is actually quite common in water parks. And it's one that uses that to great effect, as many have noted. The ride features long drops and plenty of twists and turns that make you feel like you're inside the body of a long snake. Furthermore, the ride has you being both technically eaten and spat out by an anaconda head, which you'll get to see as you exit the ride. The black anaconda sends you around 30 miles per hour, and you'll feel it from start to finish. But if you're afraid of snakes, you might want to pass on this one. Number 10, Summit Plummet. When you think about Disney World, you think of many different rides, including some water rides. But because of the family-friendly nature, you might think that there aren't any major thrill water slides. To that I say, you need to go and check out the Summit Plummet. This is a water slide that's modeled after a ski slope summit, and from a certain angle, it actually looks like it's going to rocket you off into the air just like a ski or snowboarding slope. But instead, you'll actually be going on a 360-foot ride that's near vertical, and it's fast, too. Disney is not afraid to say that this is their most extreme ride at Blizzard Beach. And that's not a lie by any stretch of the imagination. In fact, the ride is so thrilling that Disney literally asks on their website for the slide if you have the nerve to ride down it. So what do you think, do you? Number 9. Kokiri Body Plunge and Kala and Tai Nui Serpentine Body Slides It's a long name, I know. There are many types of water slides. And for those who want to go as fast as possible on these rides, there are the speed slides. In the U.S., there are two that are taller and faster than any other. The Kokiri Body Plunge and Kala and Tai Nui Serpentine Body Slides at Universal Studios Volcano Bay. Both of these slides are 125 feet tall and the slides send you careening through the mountain itself before ending up in the waters below. The 70 degree angle of the rides ensure that you are going fast. The Kokiri slide is for those who want a straight shot into the water, while the Tai Nui actually twists and turns you as you go into the volcano. You will go fast through these rides, make no mistake about it. In fact, you'll be done in 12 seconds or less. As if that weren't enough, you actually begin the ride in a launch pod and two trap doors open up before you drop into the ride. That's terrifying. These two are water slides that definitely take guts to go down, but that's probably why they're so popular. And now for number eight, but first, what's the best water park you've ever been to? Let me know in the comments below and be sure to subscribe before you leave, okay? Number eight, Scorpion's Tail. Measuring in at 10 stories high and 400 feet long, the Scorpion's Tail at the Noah's Ark Water Park in Wisconsin is without a doubt one of the most amazing water slides in the world. But not just because of its size, but rather because of the fact that this water slide has a loop in it. But why should that matter? 
Well, loops are one of the most dangerous things to put in a water slide, for if not constructed carefully, it leads to a lot of injuries, and many water slides have been shut down because of these issues. With the scorpion's tail, though, they built it in such a way that it's actually very safe, and thus it was the first successful water slide loop in the United States. The reason for its safety is based on many factors. One, a person cannot be dropped into the slide until the previous person is done and there's sufficient water in the slide for the next person. Believe it or not, there have been slides that don't do those things, and people have suffered for it. Two, the person does not take the slide straight on. Rather, they're dropped in at a 70 degree angle at 30 miles per hour to ensure they make it through the loop, which itself is not a perfect 90 degrees, but a much more manageable 60 degrees. Should the worst happen though, and a person not make the loop, there's a trap door that they can go through at the spot they'll end up at. However, this is a 1 in 100 event, so the odds are good that you'll make it through every time and thus enjoy the ride. Number 7. Boeing 747 you may hear that title and think, wait a minute, isn't that the model of an actual airplane? And you'd be right. And this is actually a hybrid of an airplane and a water slide. It's something you'll find in the Evergreen Wings and Waves Water Park in Oregon. No joke, this is a water park that is also fused with an aviation museum. Not something you usually see in combination, but hey, it's unique. Sure enough, this park actually has multiple rides that go through various airplanes, including one that has you going through the Boeing 747, and another that makes it look like you're shooting through the cockpit of another plane. Like I said, it's very unique. Number 6. Mammoth when you think of a water ride, you likely either think of a water slide or a water coaster. At Holiday World and Splash and Safari in Indiana, you'll actually find the largest water coaster in the whole world, and it's called the Mammoth. It lives up to its name too, for this ride actually has six people going across three acres of land from start to finish, yet the ride itself is only about a third of a mile long end to end. It's powered with linear induction motors, which is the same technology used for roller coasters and light rail transportation, explains Ruth McMahon, former director of Pro Slide Technology Inc. These specially adapted limbs are responsible for the mammoth's incredibly fast and steep uphill and downhill sections. Number 5. Deep Water Dive at Kentucky Kingdom, there's a water slide called the Deep Water Dive that will definitely test your nerves, for this is a slide that puts you at the top of a 121-foot drop, holds you in a capsule, and then makes you wait for it to open. And when I say open, I mean it'll drop out from underneath your feet and send you speeding towards the ground. You're basically doing a free fall drop, yet you're obviously on a slide that will send you to a safe pool at the end. The deep water dive is the tallest body slide in the world. But if you're going to try it, you need to be ready for the thrills and fear as well. Number 4. Aqualoop Slovenia may not be a place you're planning to visit in the near future, but if you're aiming to go on all the coolest water park rides, maybe you should change that notion. For at Termi 3000 in Slovenia, there's a ride called the Aqualoop that looks as epic as it is terrifying. When you reach the heights of the ride, you'll be positioned to drop down via trapdoor. Then, go at such speeds down the first section that you'll actually be able to ride up the slide and into a massive loop before safely touching down at the bottom. The Aqua Loop in Slovenia was actually the first of the trapdoor water slides, so you should pay this slide some respect. Number 3. Bullet Bowl when China hosted the 2008 Olympics, they made many things to celebrate the event, including a massive water cube structure that showed off their building skills. After the Olympics were over, they reconfigured the water cube into a water park, one that is now the largest in all of Asia, and that's no small feat. Their biggest attraction, though, is the Bullet Bowl. Here, riders will actually be spun around and around and around, just like if they were in a whirlpool. And then, when they reach the center, they'll go down a nice, dark, long drop. Eh, doesn't that just sound like a bunch of fun? <laughs> Number 2. King Cobra Another snake-themed ride, the King Cobra at Max Royal Resort in Turkey takes the idea of a snake water slide a little more literally. For you see, the slide itself is actually shaped like a King Cobra, including having you slide up the snake's head at the end. And when you do, you're going to go so fast you'll actually slide up into the snake's mouth. 
It's regarded as a game-changing water slide, says Soret Pakis of Poland Water Parks and Pool Systems. It's a high-capacity ride with two double tubes, and it's interactive because the passengers race each other. It has a strong visual impact and a unique spectator appeal, with integrated special effects such as hissing sounds. I guess if you're going to go for it, you just go big, right? And number one, Wildebeest. There are many, many water slides in the world, but when you're voted by people to be the number one water park ride in the world... Well, that means something. And that's exactly what the Wildebeest is at Holiday World and Splash and Safari in Indiana. For two and a half minutes, riders of up to four people will experience a third of a mile-long track that has them going up, down, around, and everything in between. There are twists, turns, rises, drops, underground tunnels, even a helix that you'll go around. And while two and a half minutes doesn't seem like a long time, it really is when you're going really fast. Again, this is the water park ride that has been voted number one in the world. Let's just take a second and think about all the parks and then all the slides it had to beat in order to get that honor. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Did you enjoy seeing these water slides in action? Have you been to any of them before? Let me know in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you next time.